Yes, so Abakari one I cheese with the big boys is the major problems. Now you know if you drink water, drop cup again. And a lot of people began to suspect him when they began to see him with some people. They began to have their doubts concerning this man. But at the end of the day, it came out to be true. In all their suspicions, it began became out to be true. Of course, you can say, oh, he had his life and whatever. But when you are doing something that for the fact that, hey, oh, it's your personal life and all of that, what, with the position you are holding, if anything happens, people begin to relate one or two things together. Oh, it could be as a result of this. It could be as a result of this. With that video that we just we are just watching, if nothing happened and all of that, people say, okay, that is his life. You know, what is the, what is the big deal about it? He has a right to enjoy his own life the way he wants to outside work but with this one people now begin to say mm, yes no wonder no wonder when they are, they began to see him with many many people people were just wondering what could be the this thing you know there's this thing that they always tell you talk about that uh, you know what that uh, this uh, kind of job that all these police or the security or whatever they do that they are allowed to mingle with all these criminals so that they will be able to get information from them. But that is not the case. Nobody can even say that because this is really glaring. Nigerians are still watching. Of course, Nigerians have their doubts whether this NDLA is a is a tactic to be able to for him to avoid the US extradition. But some people are beginning to see it from a different angle. But Nigerians are still holding on to that to see how all of this will end at the end of the day. How it's going to end at the end of the day. So he has rights to jollificate if he wants to. But now, with what has happened, people don't even trust him again. You know, that is it. Uh, this is his personal life. There's no big deal with him chilling in a nightclub. What uh, I'm concerned about is the cocaine deal which embarrassed his uniform. That is my concern. That is a setup for from some of his envied colleagues. They are finding a way to link the drug matter to Kubana. Kubana must be very, very careful and watchful this period because underground investigations are ongoing, of course. Yeah, right on point. I swear I like the man because we are all sinner. May God give us. All I know is that Nigeria is not worth to fight for. Hmm. After all, he, he's a, a celebrity, he's a policeman. I don't even blame him for that. I do not blame him for that. I have heard where a female see how they lived with an armed robber as his girlfriend for months just to get him and she succeeded in getting all the information to nail the criminal. Just like I said, but that is not the case here because the man has not even come out to say, oh, I was just doing a cover up or whatever. But the straight statement he made is that I pop are the ones behind is ordeal what a defense that is not what we are saying now because the man has not come out he, has, he didn't even defend it he just said oh i put behind all this is i put behind all this is i could remember when asari dokubo came out and said oh i smoked namde kano house oh he that he was instrumental to the arrest of namde kano from kenya all of them now cannot talk their mouths have been sealed what is wrong with chilling out after a hectic day? Now, wow, Niger. Uh, he's in club. He wants to get some information or IPOP and ESN are the ones that send him the use man and useless full and the government. That is the Nigeria police for you. Uh, is this one also? Yes, so it is. So it is because every little, little, little thing that Nigerians begin to read meanings to is in what has been, in what's happened in the past. There's nothing but to face. At least it will make him forget all troubles at the moment. That is how intelligence gathering works. You don't even expect him to work without realization. Nobody say he gets uh, with the bad boys. Okay. May God not let our enemies get us disgrace when it is being good for us. Mm. When he was collecting millions, he was using it. Money transferred to his brother's account. Uh -huh. Enemies did not come that time on. Enemies did not come dancing with jail chain on his hand. Okay, that is another way of finding out bad guys. Not bad, uh, bad, please, not bad. Uh -huh. That is the way he was negotiating with uh, the NDLE. Uh -huh. Even in this critical situation, he has nothing to worry about because APC government is protecting him. Oh, 
okay but he's a core muslim what was he doing in a nightclub these kind of people they usually have more than enough skeletons eating in their cupboard so don't be surprised with any additional development just wait for more one thing is that the guy was using the opportunity of okay you can mean good with the criminals to get information from them and he was using it that is the way i'm saying it he was using it to enrich himself because I, I i'm sure they must have been seeing him with all this uh kurukere movement but for the fact that uh, they still believe that he could be doing that just to get information and all of that but not knowing that the guy has already derailed doing his own thing but with the things happening now with the exposure and picking began, people began to understand that okay it was not really real. so those who are saying that eh, it is done it is allowed you can mingle with the criminals to get information forget all now wash all now wash makes no sense no crime no um it is his personal life really and so where did you keep the pictures on it now you are bringing them out of course people saw all of those things but they believe that it was just normal but now they begin to understand that it goes beyond what they thought if they dance kitty kitty dance kata kata hmm. chilling with the big boys let them fly this man to us they will treat his matter very well his muslim and people's lives matter in his hand omo niger now normal thing to party now you see a sense from enjoying himself yes now we know where it's cool enough now being a nigerian police officer should not take away his life please live his private life as of this attending a nice club to entertain himself and to stabilize his bp isn't a crime after all 70 percent of criminals are often caught in night club see 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 the way people are justifying what is not thank you so much for the video hmm, we cannot uh, see very well i thought uh, that man that muslim man doesn't go to club a bookie na bookie he doesn't even know how to dance really okay who is clean in this niger today is him tomorrow it might be you we should all be careful eh? honestly i'm short of words i really like this guy before because of his exploit not knowing that human looks at times can be deceiving i'm pained in my heart oh my god why won't he go cool off air after exploiting lots of money all work no play miss jack a doll 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 boy all work okay it is a terrible thing to play into the hands of nigerians abakari i pity you he played into his hands a bit but he enjoyed this. He enjoyed all the money. It was the handiwork of IPOB that took him to the club. <laughs>